to some kind of a LED turnout indicator for the manually switched Pico Electro Frogs. And um, I've been kind of searching on the internet and talking to people. And I did find a reference to an article in a 1997 Model Railroader Dece December issue. And it showed a, a pretty simple circuit. And I'm not real electronic, but I can follow a diagram. So what I've been able to do this morning is to make this circuit work. So you can see the green LED right here. Well, this turnout that's right here is in the normal position. So the train would be able to come in and go on this track. When I flip to the reverse circuit, you'll notice over here that the red LED went on. So the train can come into on this, on this track over here. Now what I've done is there's, um, I think this, these are three millimeter LEDs, got a diode with the, the band part, which I think is the negative, pointing towards the uh, uh, LED. And then there's a 1500 uh, watt, I think it's a, a 1500 ohm half watt resistor. It's the one I use normally for the LEDs. And then that's connected over to this track past the, uh, uh, it's a one, of, one of the wing rails here. And then the uh, other, the green LEDs hooked up to the diode uh, again, with a negative facing towards the uh, uh, the LED, another uh, resistor, and then hooked up to the other uh, track. And then when I flip the rails, you'll notice that the lights will switch. And that's all I wanted, because I've been kind of thinking about a, a panel that I want, but, you know, after playing with this layout, um, since I've got the the uh, freight yard wired now, I'm starting to have trouble seeing which which way the turnouts are because I'm not I'm not investing in the tortoises uh, as much as some people can. So this will give me uh, an ability now to uh, see which way the turnouts are and uh, I might use this throughout the layout. Uh, as you can see, I still got a lot of my uh, uh, switches for power for the uh, for the yard here over here they're still just dangling i got them dangling all the way uh, over um, there's 10 of them and just because i have not decided on where i'm putting the panel yet but anyway that's kind of what i've been working on um, i have been able to run uh, trains throughout the freight yard um, and I'll do another another video later on, but I thought this was kind of cool that uh, I kind of figured this out and uh, I'd like to share it with everybody. Um, and the, the last thing you have to do uh, is you take the uh, this wire here. It's connected to each of the other legs of the LED and you connect that one to the uh, the the output of the frog where, where it splits. But remember now, all of my turnouts have a uh, power break after them, just like they go, it, it discusses in DCC uh, for wiring um, or wiring for DCC. Uh, you got to do that with these Pico Electro Frogs. And uh, like I say, they work, they work pretty good. So but anyway, that's all for now. Thanks for watching. Bye.